classroom transforms the artist, going beyond the surface, revealing the genius behind the music. Performing with a live band really expresses your showmanship. You develop a vision and then you live by it. And you got a pop up classroom concert series take it. What up, classmates? It's the legendary Yeti checking in. Professor P, A1, holla at the class, man. show but to see more than that you gotta come to us fam i think i just stopped paying the child support for myself you gotta hear what i just said i'm paying the child support for my own body for my dad i think rap is is, is more potent than drugs i think music goes straight to the soul you know what i'm saying they don't really fuck with rap they don't support it you feel me like they don't want that shit being heard about and seen like be self-aware is, 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 you know, that's God level. You know what I'm saying? To know exactly where you are, who you are in that moment. That's a, you know, it's a very God-like thing. Hey man, actually it feel great doing the show. It's a great experience. This ain't my first time performing with a live band, but um, I like it, man, because they was able to adapt on the fly. I've, I've done some when they were able to catch me. I feel great coming off that stage and classroom concert. It was lit, man. The whole atmosphere, ambiance, everything with the band, the lights, the classroom. We're considered instruments, as far as singers, we're considered instruments. So, me being the instrument, do a beat in my head, so I'll be like, don't, 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 don't. And then I start, uh, When they hit me up to do classroom concerts, with no hesitation, I told them, I'm down to do it. Just tell me when to show up, and I'm a rap. This is truly a fire brand, a fire movement. Classroom concerts is dope. Um, I started out in the classroom as a rapper and a college student. So to come full circle and be doing a classroom concert years later, that's only God. And the South still got something to say. The big E had the big nine eight. This when I first see Screw. Nigga, you can draw, can't you? I'm like, yeah, nigga, I can draw. So I'm giving them drawings. Fat Pat, Hawk, all them on the porch. We in the circle in the cul-de-sac. Niggas out there ranking. Fat Pat was a motherfucking comedian out this world. That's when I got introduced to the screwed up clique. My big bro, make some motherfucking noise for my big bro one time. That nigga wanted my inspiration, my nigga, I swear to God. This is a place where knowledge is known and love is shown. <laughs>